Hello everyone, this is Penny. This is my Health in Bite Size and for this week, we are on the topic of bread spreads. We already talked about butter and jam jelly, sandwich bread, and peanut butters, but today we're going to talk about cheese-based spreads. Now, cheese-based spreads is, of course, you'd expect it to be with cheese, divide right? uh, And I think the most popular brand is Cheese Whiz and followed by Cheesy dito sa Pilipinas. But of course, all over the world, it's I think it's Kraft Cheese Whiz. Now, eto yan. Let's, let's discuss, diba? Yung totoong cheese ba, um, how was it uh, converted into something that was cheese is a solid, uh, you know, solid block. But then, how did it uh, turn into something that's flowy, that's easily spreadable? Well, ito yan. Um, yung totoong cheese, when you heat it up, you'll end up separating the fat from the cheese solid. So, what happens is you have an oil and then a lumpy, lumpy, sticky mess. Diba? Parang ganun siya. So, that's not the cheese whiz that we know at all. So, ito yan. Enter processed cheese. What is processed cheese? Yun din. Uh, way back, years and years and years uh, ago, ganun din yun. Uh, Pinulverize nila, hinit up nila, and then they added a lot of emulsifiers. Meaning, uh, emulsifiers will... Uh, cause the cheese solids and the oil to mix together. Kumbaga, magiging magkabati na sila and they will agree to really, you know, just roll with each other and come out in a product that's flowy and easily spreadable. But you know, over the years, if you will look at the, uh, if you will look at the ingredients of the, of these products right now, the cheese-based spreads, whatever kind of there is that you will look at uh, in the market right now, you will find that there are like, halimbawa, ito ha, uh, cheese whiz okay uh, water cheese coconut oil glucose syrup which is sugar milk protein skim milk emulsifier sodium phosphate which is with what we said uh, is um is an emulsifier para para mag mix siya together and then at yung nat nat nagtataka ko natural and nature identical cheese flavor spices modified food starch natural color kumbaga marami pang na add na other forms of cheese or mm, cheese like flavors that why do they need to do that you know why um well sabi nga uh, in order to make this product really a practical thing to buy, you know, you have to remove a lot of the real cheese and replace it with something that, you know, tastes like, smells like, feels like cheese. And it's like something that they can actually produce in the laboratory. So that if you look, if you compare the old, old um, uh, cheese spread from before and the cheese spread now, you'll find that there's so much less cheese in the modern cheese spread today.